Hey, what's up guys? Chris Flick here. And you know, this morning I was uh, listening to a little TED Talk, which is something I don't typically do too often. But, um, you know, a link was shared to me through a group that I follow. Uh, the group is all, it's, it's designed and it's geared towards, you know, athletic development and really developing our child, our children to like maximize their full potential, teach them how to have fun, how to play and all that good stuff. And this TED Talk was with a man named Stuart Brown. Now, Stuart Brown's a psychologist at the University of Stanford. And he's had, a, he, because he's a psychologist, he has some experience in some crazy situations. One of them that he, he kind of came across earlier in his career was, um, I think the man's name was the Texas Tower Murderer. And basically what he found with this individual is that not only, you know, the parents beat him, they were alcoholics, but they also deprived this man from, sli uh, from play, sorry. So they really, play deprivation was a huge part of his upbringing. And because of that, certain aspect parts of his brain didn't develop in the way that a kid who was allowed to play, how that kid's brain would develop. And there's all kinds of studies out there about rats, and when you deprive play from them, the effects it has on their brain development. You know, another aspect too that he mentioned with rats, they allowed one group of rats to play, and they deprived play in the other group of rats. And then they introduced a collar into their little pen um, that smelled like a cat. And these, these rats are hardwired to be afraid of cats. So once that collar was introduced, they all ran and hid. Um, the cats that were deprived of play stayed hidden until they died. Literally, play being deprived from play led to their death. And what this really starts thinking about is the importance that play has in our survival and our adaptation into who we are today. Those rats that did play previously, after that rat collar was introduced, then they started sniffing around a little bit. They got a little bit more curious. They started looking, they started peeking around corners. They're like, hey, I think we actually might be okay to get out there. So that teaches us, basically, you know, this is, this is hard to say because it is rats. But what do we have here is that what play teaches us, the play teaches us to explore, it, it, it allows us to be curious, it allows us to take some chances and partake in a little bit of risky behavior, feel out the situation, not to the, to the point that you're going to harm yourself, but it just allows you to explore and, and, and try new things and experience new things. It's pretty crazy, it's, a, it's super important you know, for all of us, not only our children, to kind of explore, stay curious, and to continue playing. All right, I hope you guys like this one. Peace, everybody.